Hey guys, oh Janelle here. Welcome back to my channel and in today's video I am making some eco custard. Oh Janelle is not my name and you must know it's a statement. Bitch. <laughs> So I've had a few of you guys hit me up saying how grateful you guys were that I put that video out there because it really worked for you. So I figured I would do an updated video. Um, I need y'all to understand something. There's no specific recipe. I just throw whatever I find in the house inside. <laughs> so here is my big tub of Pink Eco. You guys know this particular Eco Styler is my staple. And then here in the smaller jar is where I'm gonna mix it. And here is my multiple oils that are gonna go in here. So this is some coconut oil. I've got some vitamin E oil. I think this is castor oil, I don't know. <laughs> Grapeseed oil. Sweet almond oil tea tree oil I don't know what this is but I've got some jojoba oil and I've also got some African shea oil from Ghana so basically what I'm going to do is use this big old pink spoon and I'm going to scoop a nice amount of this gel into the smaller bottle a new one because now the pink is shiny and I don't really recall it having this glitter effect in there so I'm really hoping that they did not change the formula can you guys see that like the glitter in there because if they change this formula listen to me I'm gonna be real mad have any of you guys um, noticed that or am I just bugging please let me know down below so, like I've said, there's no specific recipe, guys. I pretty much just put a couple drops of whatever inside of here. And this has always worked perfectly fine for me. So, let's do just that. So, the first thing that I'm going to put inside is, oh my gosh, some jojoba oil. I'm going to... Oh my gosh, why am I making such a mess today? I'm just going to squeeze some of that in there. Up next, I'm going to put some coconut oil. Barely coming out, but okay. Let me just... Then I'm going to put in just a little tea tree. Sweet almond. Vitamin E, some grape seed oil that I've never actually even opened before, but let's see how we like it. African shea oil, castor oil, because I don't know what this is, but I'm just gonna put some in there anyway. It smells, um, So, now why we call it custard is because for whatever reason, when you mix all the oils in with the gel, it turns white. Now, I put a lot of the oils because this is a bigger container. I used to use like the smaller jars. some muscle in there try to get it at the bottom like if you see the bottom is still like a little clear and the rest of it is starting to turn white so I'm gonna keep mixing I'm gonna be honest with you guys like I've been super lazy lately and I have not like made this in a while it's probably been over a month but um nothing sets my wash and go like an eco custard so staple for life and if you guys want um, later on 
I'll do a wash and go video with the custard for those of you who don't know how good it is. So we are about done mixing. Here's a final product. It has turned a very opaque color. You can no longer see through this jar. And I am here for it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you in my next video. And like I said, if you do want to see a wash and go video using the Eco Custard, just let me know down below. See you in my next video. It's something we're fighting for. I won't let you go because I love you. I won't let you go. You're the only one I want. Something we're fighting for. I can't let you go because I love you. I don't want no more. You don't want to fight no more.